In the beginning, I didn't think that this wheel would be for me, but someone saw something in me that I'm able to help someone else. I was always a person interested in relationships, and even when I was in elementary school, when my friends are faced with some kind of a dilemma, I was the one always trying to bring peace of being the mediator. I always find myself drawn to relationships and how each one in relation affects another, and I've always been the go-to person when it comes to a listening ear and just to give advice. Essentially building rapport with them and getting them to feel comfortable within the space that they're in. Yeah, in this profession, you have to have patience, passion, and perseverance. If you don't, it's not going to be for you. Definitely, there, there's going to be a lot of things that can trigger you. Each of us have our varying triggers, and learning how to deal with it is important. Really trying to find not only the balance within yourself, but your relationships. It just builds into a conversation, and then they just expect you to be their therapist. Like they say, every therapist needs a therapist. Self-care is, it's, it's an imperative, especially for people who are, who are therapists, right? Need somewhere to dump, so I would say balance is very important. I personally like to have a massage. I like to have my nails done. And there are times when I just need to sleep. You have to find empathy so that you can see them succeed. It's about others, mm -hmm. right? So it's about the client. You're there to help, basically. That's the stance you take. I've been in the field for 10 years advocating for individuals with disabilities. I'm helping my individuals find a part in drama. It's always so rewarding when you see light bulbs go on. Most recently here, it was really rewarding just yesterday because what one of my clients really started to um, make the connection between the work that they're doing here, the assignments that they need to work on on their own as individuals when they're not here. Um, and it was, you could really see growth in that client, kind of the, the reminder of why, why I'm doing this. I feel very useful and that I've been able to make that kind of impact in their life and to see that they move from stage to stage or see some kind of growth, whether it's incremental or otherwise. It bring, actually brings tears to my eyes emotionally because um, they didn't, they never thought they had it in them until you actually hear them open up their mouth. So that's a, it's a, it's a happy moment for me.